morning. That's the way it goes. Let's move on. Colorado Buffaloes. Five and seven last year. Mike McIntyre got fired. They went two and seven in conference. Uh, started out nicely, five and zero, oh, and then lost every game down the stretch. Uh, got, what do you think the chances are they start off five and zero oh this year? Probably not good. Yeah, not really. Actually, really not <laughs> zero, good. Zero. Uh, probably yeah, zero percent chance. Zero is close. Yeah. yeah. I, uh, although I mean, it's maybe all right. Maybe not zero percent, but I just I don't see it. Uh, experience number eighty eight in the country. Number eight in the conference. They got six guys uh, back on offense, six, I mean, uh, five starters back on defense. New head coach Mel Tucker went from the NFL to Alabama to Georgia. Now, the question is, how is he going to do with less talent in Boulder? Now, he'll tell you that there's not less talent. Well, yeah, he has to. But he would be a liar. That's his job. Yeah. So, quarterback Steven Montez returns. That's definitely a good thing, along with wide receiver LaVisca Chenault, who, when healthy, May be the most explosive player in the country. I mean, he's unbelievable, um, but he missed a ton of games last year. So, three out of five offensive linemen returning. They need a rushing attack, uh, either Alex Fontenot or Deion Smith. Uh, linebacker Nate Lamon and defensive end Mustafa Johnson. They're going to be leaders on the defense. They need to improve their passing defense. Uh, they were number 74 in the country last year. Gave up over 234 yards a game. Um, having a senior quarterback is big, but... This schedule is atrocious. I mean, it is really, really rough. It's uh, tough. I, I've got them at three. and I, Oh, the over-under for them, by the way. Arizona State's over-under seven. Over is minus 125. Under plus 105. Uh, Colorado's is three and a half. Over is even money at plus 100. Under is minus 120. Whew. So Vegas thinks that they are going to go under. Um, so I, I've, I've got them... I've got them two and ten, and I have a question mark, maybe three and nine. I've got them three and nine. I've got them one and eight in conference. I've got a win over Arizona for them. Oh, okay. So if the other wins, I've got a win over Air Force, a win over Colorado State, uh, losing to Nebraska, losing to uh, at Arizona State, and then man, they lose uh, at Oregon, at Washington State, USC, at UCLA, Stanford, Washington, at Utah. Yep. That is brutal. I mean, it, it, even with a senior quarterback, that is. I have I have rough. no idea. So I have Colorado, I have Air Force with a question mark, and then I have nothing else. But I think they're gonna win a conference game. Yeah, I think I just I think don't that Arizona game. Any, I just don't know anywhere where it's gonna happen. So Arizona comes off of a bye week. Um, at home off a of bye, usually probably a pretty good bet to yeah. to catch somebody. Yeah, I mean, I, I think I could that's, see that. I think that's how that works. So uh, three and nine in Mel Tucker's first year. I think this is kind of a year zero thing. Everybody oh, yeah. understands. I, nobody's going to judge him for how he does this year unless he does really well. Yeah, and then they're going to judge him in a good light, but and and maybe in a not fair light. But that's we'll right. See. That's right. 